Hey, what's up, everybody? The 2023 West Point Proof American Silver Eagle. How high will the vintage get? What is the current sales of that 2023 West Point Proof American Silver Eagle? That's going to be the discussion on this video today. Please hit that thumbs up on the video. Let me know your thoughts, your opinions in that comment section below. But earlier in the year, before this coin even went on sale on that March the 2nd date, it was told to us that this coin was meant to demand. Not so much by the United States Mint, but from a few of them online articles said that this was a mint to demand coin. But for the last several months at least every time i looked at it it was a blue remind me just for the 23 ea however within the last couple of weeks it did indeed go back to that red add to the bag so how many more of the west point proof american silver eagles has the united states mint been selling and what is the current sales but also what could this sales get to on this coin by the end of the year maybe even going into 2024 because the united states mint absolutely could continue selling this coin into next year not only is this west point proof american silver eagle the 23 ea back to that red add to the bag that glowing red button but the 2023 congratulations set with that exact same coin but for two dollars more is also still that red add to the bag this did very briefly after that march 2nd date go to that blue remind me button but it has been that red that glowing red add to the bag ever since with the product limit of 40,000. And when we talk about United States mint sales and potential mintages, we indeed do have to include the sales for this congratulations set, as well as the sales for this one here, the 23EA, and of course, all the coins that they sold within the 40 coin bulk packs. As I previously stated, now I do not watch this coin a whole lot, but every now and then I do go back to this West Point Proof American Silver Eagle and just want to see if it has that blue remind me button or the red add to the bag. And for the last couple of months, every time I went to go check it out, it indeed was that blue remind me button. So I wanted to see, did the United States Mint actually sell any of these over the last couple of months? Just because I haven't seen that red add to the bag button doesn't mean that it didn't go to that red add to the bag button at 7.30 in the morning time, Eastern time, every single day, and then go back to the blue remind me button. So I wanted to see, has the United States been selling these coins this whole time? So as of July, the second sales report, the United States Mint reported sales of 424,411 coins and 40 coin bulk packs was 2,106. And then going to the July 30th sales report, it looks like they did end up selling some from July the 2nd to July the 30th. They reported sales for 23 EA of 424,000. 546 and they also sold a few of them 40 coin bulk packs from 2106 to 2119 then if we go from the july 30th sales report to the august 6th sales report they did report a few sales although not very much from 424,546 to 424,000 574 as of August the 6th, 2023, and the 40 coin bulk pack did not change from the July 30th to the August 6th sales report. Then when we go from the August 6th sales report to the current sales report, as of the recording of this video, it is August the 27th, 2023. That is the current sales report. And the United States Mint has reported sales for the 23EA of 424,900. 
111. So as we look at the progression of sales from the July the second sales report, and I only picked this date because I do believe in July, for the most part in July, this coin has been at that blue. Remind me, so that's why I wanted to go back to July to see how many they have sold. It does seem like the sales did pick up quite a bit from the August 6th sales report to the August 27th sales report for the 23 EA, but for the 40 coin bulk pack, the dealers, it looks like, have not been buying any of these since the July 2nd sales report. The 40 coin bulk pack has been at a standstill at that 2,119 since the July 30th sales report. So from July the 30th to August the 6th, to August the 27th, the dealers have not been buying any more of these, but the United States Mint has been selling more of these through the 23EA, the coin that comes in just the OGP, the original government packaging. So what is the current sales, aka approximate mintage so far, but keep in mind the United States Mint is still selling these, so chances are this mintage is going to go up. How long will they keep selling them for? How high will the mintage go? Your guess is as good as mine, but you can give me a guess in the comment section below. I will be showing you what the sales or mintage of the 2022 West Point Proof American Silver Eagles are. And will it get that high? Will it get to that number or beyond that number? We're going to talk about that in just a few moments. But the current sales or current mintage of this coin when you combine the 2,119 of the 40 coin bulk packs and the 424,911 of these, but wait, you also have to include that 2023 congratulations set with 37,895. So when you include all three of these, the congratulations set, as well as the 40 coin bulk pack and the 424,911 that the general public bought, that comes out to a whopping total of 547,560. Six. Is that a high number of sales or approximate mintage? In my opinion, you're darn right it is. Now, how does that compare to last year's totals for the 2022 West Point Proof American Silver Eagle? I'm glad you asked because we're going to look at that right now. Last year, the 2022 congratulations set, the United States Mint sold 29,710. And then they also sold 496,992 of the 22 EA that they sold to the general public and a big total of 4,107 of the 40 coin bulk packs. And the 40 coin bulk packs, the 4,107 would come out to 164,280 of the coins sold within the 40 coin bulk packs. And when you do add together the 40 coin bulk pack and the 22 EA plus the 29,710 in the congratulations set, that comes out to a total of 690,982. So big totals for 2023, even bigger totals for 2022. Now, the fascinating thing about this is that the sales, even though the price of the proof American Silver Eagles and pretty much everything went up in price at the United States meant for 2023, but that really didn't slow down or stop sales very much. If you look at the 2023 proof American Silver Eagle, the totals between 2023 and 2022, really the big difference is not so much how many of these they sold to the general public, but keep in mind, this number could keep going up because this is still for sale. But the difference really isn't that big from the 23 EA and the 22 EA. The difference between the 23 EA and the 22 EA is a little over 
82,000. The big difference, where the big difference comes in, is how many the dealers bought in 2022 via the 40 coin bulk pack and how many they're not buying in 2023. They bought about half as much in 2023 so far. They could possibly keep buying more. Who knows? Currently, they've only bought half as many in 2023 than they bought in 2022. But it seems like the dealers have pretty much halted their buying of the 2020. Three West Point proof American Silver Eagle. Now, the one thing that we do not know is what the United States Mint put on as far as limits. Did the United States Mint cap the dealers at how many of these West Point proof American Silver Eagles they can purchase? Not sure if they capped them or not. We are currently on eBay looking at the most recently sold listings for the 2023 West Point proof american silver eagle and this is something i often like to do just to get an idea for if something is holding their value appreciating their value or decreasing in value so we're just going to take a quick look at how much some of these west point proof american silver eagles are selling for and the first one that we see is 2023 west point proof american silver eagle with black box and coa direct from the united states mint now these coins did sell from the united states mint in the ogp for eighty dollars and this one sold not very much over that eighty six dollars and three dollars for shipping and then the next one after that well we are coming across some fake american silver eagles from china so please be aware of those then we have a couple of graded examples one this one here is a proof 70 ultra cameo first day of issue for a hundred and three dollars only twenty three dollars or twenty three dollars and eighty nine cents over the issue price from the united states in which it comes in that black box with coa but this one is a graded example proof 70 23 dollars and 89 cents over issue price and that pretty much is the issue price including the grading fees and then this one here has a trump label and this was a proof 70 ultra cameo first day of issue and this one sold for 133 dollars and 50 cents but also free shipping next one is in the original government packaging and that one sold not very much over the issue price $84.95 plus $3.95 for shipping this one here look at this so this one is a NGC proof 70 that sold for just six dollars and ninety cents over the issue price from the united states mint and then this one here is a 2023 west point proof silver eagle proof 70 for 113 dollars so if you're someone who likes to buy these coins and send them off for grading and trying to chase proof 70s in a lot of cases in most cases maybe not every case but as you can see in a lot of cases it's much easier or cheaper i should say to buy them in my opinion off of the secondary market or from one of the dealers one of the big dealers on ebay versus chasing those 70s because if you bought it from the united states mint for 80 dollars and then you have to probably pay 25 30 dollars for the grading fees plus the shipping and all that shipping to and shipping back and then you have to pay to insure it well you can see from these prices that you can pretty much save all that effort and just buy it already graded on the secondary market but then some people don't like graded coins some people rather just have their coins in the original government packaging straight from the united states mint so i can indeed see both sides this one here what is this ngcx graded a 10 and look at this this one phoenix a and a and this one so look at that 76 dollars. is this a proof oh no wait this is yeah it says it's a proof it says 2023 west point eagle so this doesn't say 
if it's approved on here. It looks like it's approved. All right, so it actually does look like it says proof right above the 10. So I'm not really familiar with these NGCX labels. Instead of saying proof 10 right in the center of the label, you have the number 10, and then it says in little print proof right above the 10 and then right below the 10 it looks like it says ultra cameo and then it just says 2023 w for west point eagle phoenix a and a release but it only sold for 76 dollars so very interesting and then this one this one here is definitely a proof this is a 2023 west point proof 69 ultra cameo and this one went below issue price i appreciate everybody for taking the time out of your day to watch this video please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button on the video let me know your thoughts your opinions in that comment section below of everything that we spoke about on this video the sales numbers or approximate mintages for the 2023 west point proof american silver eagle the sales for the 23 ea the congratulations set the 40 coin bulk packs and how much these coins are currently selling for on the secondary market let me know your thoughts about all that in the comment section below like comment subscribe share and i'll talk to everybody on my next video thanks everyone